welcome to some animation review. Do do do. Let me just get back to the end. Anyways, before we start, I would like to give a big thank you to you guys. Last animation absolutely did pretty well. It actually got 140 few four views, which isn't my most viewed video, but you know what? Beggars can't be choosers. And, well, I don't know. I think that's fine for me. I, I got a lot of subscribers from that, which I'm very thankful for. I was, like, at 28 when I released it, and now I'm at 72, so... I mean, almost tripled, like, wait, yeah, I've tripled, I've almost quadrupled, fun, anyways, uh, yeah, we're starting another animation, now I'm better, I learned a lot from the Tonga and all my other animations, basically those were just my training, I need to become the best animator, well, not really, but it was a joke, and anyways, let's, let's, let's see the new segment, and here we see. The hot chocolate in his natural habitat. Dun, dun, dun. It's mine, is where we will go deep. Yup, someplace we may never return. You won't. There has been no study done in this sector. There hasn't. No study at all. Uh uh. It's too crazy. <gasps> You will party forever. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to some animation. So my random thoughts, or just random things. I think I can. The list can go on and on. One. I get very beautiful clip, right? Okay, let's break it down and teach you some things about animation. So maybe your head can get a little bit fuller. I don't know about you, but I don't think. I don't think my brain cell can get any more fuller. Science knocked that one out. <laughs> Anyways, um, so we we have our beautiful man right here. Beautiful drawing by me. Thank you, thank you. Um, so now we just add a keyframe with the little add keyframe button, and you go. <laughs> until your audio segment is done, and then you just. Add another keyframe, and and you basically so the if you don't know how this works, you just you hit a button, and then you can make the size of what the other keyframe will be, and it'll make a smooth animation up to that keyframe. So smooth animation gets from small, and I enlarged it a bunch. So on this keyframe, it's humongous, so it slowly goes from small to huge, and then this. It's just a blinker frame, honestly, nothing special, you just, it's literally two frames switching between each other. Um, can I get this to go away? No, I, bro, I hate this sometimes about Toon Boom. Also, that, that's what I use to, um, yeah, there we go, okay, I did it. Anyways, um, uh, blah, blah, blah. um, what is that talking about? Anyways, blinker frame, so you just draw one frame, blah, 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 blah. uh, Copy it, and draw another flame. Blah, 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 blah. Beautiful. And now you just swap between them. Do, 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 do. And... <gasps> da, 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 da. Yeah, beautiful. Pretty easy. This... Okay, so we get our stationary object playing up here. Sta stationary the whole time. It's not moving. And then we're going to have our moving object down here. So, since I don't have, like... And some people, when they do this, they'll either, they'll have, like, a character rig. Well, they, all, all the body parts of the character are all rigged up so they can move it around, blah, 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 blah. I don't do that. I just, because I'm never going to have more than two things moving in a sequence at once. So, basically, all I do is I just have my randoms, which I can do anything I want to. And they can just be random objects moving in space space doesn't matter what they are i just throw them in there real quick not a specific thing just anything if that utterly confused you this is basically where my moving objects go whenever i need something to move around that's not going to be hand animated anyways so we have my arm so you start off with an arm image and you use the rotate animate tool and you go from here and you rotate it and then you go a few frames over and then you rotate it and it automatically animates it from there to there. Beautiful. And I just repeat, add some variation. Don't make it the same every time. So it looks a little bit like 
it's not just copy and paste it over and over again. That kind of looks boring. Oh, I haven't talked about these. Reset keyframes. So your keyframes, and it's actually probably better to prove this over here. Um, reset keyframes. Okay, so you gotta, you gotta use a keyframe to reset what you've done. Like to reset, if I'm reset, I gotta reset this enlarging and make it not enlarge. Because right now, if I just... If I import any old, uh, let's import this guy. He's giant too. He becomes humongous. That's not what we want. We want it to immediately flash back to the same size it was. So we just add a keyframe, which shrunken down a bunch. So now if I add back my, um, my little man here, look, he's normal sized again. So this just flashes it back to your, your original size. And we do that, uh, wrong place, um, here, to reset the original rotation. Amazing. And then we go into blinker frames, more blinker frames. Draw this real quick. Rotate tool on all of these letters. And then I moved him up a little bit so it looks like he's jumping with joy. This one, draw this. This actually took me a while to draw because it's kind of complicated. And... Okay, so in the animation review, we're going to go get a random guy off the street and see if he can tell what these are, because apparently some people can't tell what my drawings are. That one's a snake. That one's a house. That one's a human. That, that, that's a snail. That, that's a donut. This is special fancy font. That's a cloud. That's a chair. That's a 3D letter. That's a Dr. Doofenshmirtzinator ray. Uh, that's, that's a G with a light bulb on it, that's a chair with a person, and this is a person that looks oddly like a T, and an S that looks like it got forgotten because it has cobwebs on it. Thank you, you guessed all of them right, surprisingly. <laughs> anyway, so we just move them all up and down, it doesn't matter, you can do this any way you want, it's literally just two different frames that it flashes between. Copy as long as you want, and then this. I just wanted to do a random thing, so first thing that came to my mind, cheese. It's random. I I don't have to explain myself. Um, yeah. I just add, let, enlarge it a little bit, but not smooth it. No smoothing, it's just a boom. And then add more cheese, and then, and then even more cheese, and with exclamation point, because it's, it's cheese. And I had some people don't get that that when I'm saying random things that that's a random thing. Yeah, sometimes people are stupid like me. <laughs> Anyways, and then here, um, I said one, so got a one, got a bunch of different ways to spell one. Not spell, just say it. Okay. I don't know. I I'm off my rocker today. <laughs> um, so we just have keyframe here. Move it around. Keep frame there. Move it around some more. Keep from there, and, it, and it's yeah, just amazing. Anyways, I hope your head is a little bit fuller, and you didn't get extremely bored. So please like and subscribe. Uh, goodbye, and I don't know when this whole animation will be dropping. It's non-existent, cause I don't want to set myself a time constraint, cause I will procrastinate. Anyways, yeah. Goodbye!